glad you did too. So imagine how awkward that is. <laughs> You're like going on your first dates as, a, as an adult. Being happy and not being able just to be around my family and friends and being open and honest with them. So it was just living for 25 years like that. I was like, what am I doing? Things like that. Things, um, you know, could have learned what I really wanted in a relationship at that age or, or, you know, certain things that people, you know, as, as young adults get to learn and get to go through. Um, but, you know, I am the person I am today because of my experiences and living in different places and going through those struggles. So I don't regret, you know, I've been interested in different, different things. I don't know if that's my, you know, sexual orientation. I think, you know, it's maybe the way I was raised just to be right. uh, multifaceted and to be interested in different things. And it could just so so great for me to learn how to run a business and design and working with fabrics and all that stuff so it's been a big passion of me and design and work shorts and pants so trousers and it's been awesome you know, we're in stores like kitson fred siegel other stores you know it's continued to grow uh multifaceted and to be interested in different things and to continue to keep going i mean when i'm when my off season starts it's like it's two or three days, and I'm like, all right, when are we getting back to training? When are we getting, and I start running and doing a bit too much. So I don't, I don't really think that has anything to do with me being a gay man. I just think that has me being hungry to live. So to write about it and to write about, you know, my family, my parents going through divorce or, or different uh, experiences I had with my mom and dad and my brothers and sisters, and, and yeah. I wasn't expecting it to be so emotional. And uh, <laughs> I'd be working with Eric. Eric came out to L.A. and stayed here. And I go to train the next day, and I'd be like, just like so emotional to everything that was going around me, you know. If training was going bad, or if guys were, you know, say we lost the game, I would be like overly sensitive to certain things. And, and my first year, I had a bunch of injuries, so it was like just uh, so many different things that I was kind of dealing with. But, but in a good way, I think you have to accept those and work on those. And, and who I am, I think that stuff was, you know, it's the best thing that could have happened to me. And, and you know, I'll have to deal with those kind of things, you know, forever and learn from them, but um, writing a book uh, has been so helpful for just me as an adult, as, uh, as a man. Sun is up, happy, happy, happy day, love, 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 sway, <laughs> merry day.